Alright ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of ASA, the series where I answer your questions. I really do love this series and I appreciate each and every one of you always taking the time to comment something down below and asking me a question. So that being said, if you have a question for next ASA, please leave it in the comments down below. So anyways, let's get into the video starting with the Lego Pork. He says, are you excited for the Skywalker Saga Lego game and what is your favorite Lego game? Um, to answer the first question, yes, I am very excited. I'm going to be getting the game as soon as it comes out. I'll probably even play, <coughs> excuse me, um, I'll probably even play the game like in some of these videos so like I'll be answering questions and you'll be watching me play uh, the game in the background which is gonna be fun um, and to answer your second question Lego Star Wars Complete Saga will probably forever always be my favorite Lego game just it's just an amazing Lego game let's be honest here so yeah anyways our next question comes from Jawa and he says do you like the new brick sketches sets Yes, I actually do. Um, I couldn't really care less about the DC ones. They're cool, don't get me wrong, the Batman and the Joker, but I'm going to get the Star Wars ones. They were supposed to come out yesterday, or I guess now, today being Wednesday. Hey, Patrick, are you angry too? Yeah. What's the matter? I can't see my forehead. What's your problem? Lego didn't release the new brick sketches like they were supposed to. They were supposed to come out two days ago, so on Monday, and they never did. So I have no idea what's up with that. I was really looking forward to getting them, and I was going to do a review and a speed build of them. Um, so we'll see what happens. Maybe they'll come out later this month. I hope so. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to getting them because I think they're cool. I really do. I, I'm going to give them a chance. Like a lot of people are like, oh, that's horrible. But I, I think you got to give it a chance first, right? So... Anyways, our next question comes from E.K. Starlord, and he says, do you like, no, not do you like, why do I always say that? <sighs> Let me just start off, I'm sorry. E.K. Starlord, he says, do you think we will get a duel on Exegol set in 2021? Um, mm, I have no idea, Um, but I'm going to say I hope so, because I will get it, unless it's like a UCS set, which I don't think they would do that in UCS form so it might be an expensive play set or it might be like one of those small like dual sets at like $20 so either way I'll get it as long as it's not like uber duper expensive right so um yeah I would I would hope that we get one it, so but do I think we're gonna get one chances probably not but I never know with Lego you, you never know like I don't think anybody knows so anyways our next question comes from Brickman. He says, do you like the new Technic Lamborghini? Personally, I love the color scheme, but it's a bit pricey. Um, I'm not really into Lego Technic or cars either, like in real life. So, I mean, I guess it's cool looking at this picture. Yeah, it's, it's nice. Um, I do like the color too. I will agree with that. But other than that, I couldn't care less. So, yeah. Um, anyways... I keep saying, and anyways, at the end of the question, I'm sorry if that's getting annoying. Um, our next question comes from Deepest Salt. He says, good video. You're growing so fast, but that's not the question, right? Um, so then I was just messing with him, but, you know, I said, probably because of the giveaway, lol. Then I said, also, you forgot to ask me a question. And then he said, well, then here's a question then. When do you... Wait, when do you announce the giveaway winners? It's over. Our next question comes from Jam Man. He says, favorite Jedi and Sith. Favorite Jedi, hands down, Obi-Wan. I will always and forever love Obi-Wan. Favorite Sith, Darth Maul. But does that really count? Because he's not really a Sith after episode one. Formerly Darth. Now just more. Um, but I'm still gonna count it anyway, so I love Darth Maul. Our next question comes from Ace Gamer Studios, and he says, if you were able to choose one character at to the Lego Star Wars, the Skywalker saga, who would it be? Um Honestly, I don't really play Lego games for the characters because they're pretty much always the same, let's be honest here. Um but one thing I do hope, I'm assuming this question means who do I hope will be in the game. Um, one character I do hope will be in the game, or several I should say, would be the Jedi Ghost, like from the original 
Lego Star Wars game just because they're cool because they're like invincible and no one attacks them and they can still interact with like the world like by building stuff and pulling levers and stuff like that so I hope that they add the Jedi ghosts to the game so that way you can play levels without getting bombarded bombarded with annoying people shooting you all the time you know um so yeah that's what I'm gonna say I hope we get um force ghost in that game so that way we can play it you know and not get annoyed so yeah our next question comes from Petafreight. hopefully i said that right it's got a bit of a long question so i'm just going to shorten it by um saying what the question is you can pause the screen and read it if you would like but he says um what lego star wars set would i make if i like could choose what they make um and that has like never been made before or at least in the last two years and i'm gonna go ahead and say a death trooper helmet i really like those new helmet sets and i really hope that they continue doing so because those are just cool like collectible like display sets and they're nice and cheap i, I mean 60 dollars might be a lot to some people but $60 to me is a reasonable price for a nice display set. So um, I'm going to say a Def Trooper helmet and just to make everybody mad, a Luke Speeder Micro Fighter. Luke's Land Speeder Micro Fighter. I should be more specific. I said that wrong. Anyways, I, I did it again. I, I keep doing that. I do apologize. Our next question comes from Dark Jedi Films. And once again, he has a long question, um, but I'll read this one out. Is This is hard to put. Did anyone of your classmates, friends, family, teachers, etc. discover your channel and how did they react to it? I have heard that if you are discovered still doing Lego videos when you are in school, uh, especially high school, then they bully you. Ah, hmm. yeah, see, that's a bit of a tough one, right? Um, I just want to kind of put something out there real quick um if you are if anyone watching this is going through any of that like you're getting bullied because you're enjoying making videos on youtube uh regardless of what it is like lego or minecraft or literally anything don't let people bully you for that don't don't let that bug you i know people are going to bully you always there's always going to be haters right haters are going to hate right that's what they always, they say um but you just got to not let that bug you, you know, and I know it can be tough sometimes to form thick skin, if you will, but sometimes you just got to ignore it because people are just dumb, I guess. Um, but thankfully in my life, no, I've never had anybody make fun of me for doing Lego videos. Um, pretty much everybody I know knows that I have a channel because I told them, um, but one of my friends, when she first found out that I had a channel, she was like super excited about that. And she was like, don't tell me what it is. I want to find it. Um, and then for like maybe a good month, she would just like be like, are you this person? Are you this person? Are you this person? I'm like, nope, nope, nope. And then eventually she was just like, fine, just tell me who are you? And I told her and she's like, oh, I passed you. And I didn't even think that was you. So that was funny. Um, but Thankfully, in my life, what I'm getting at is I don't have anyone, like, bullying me and being like, Hi, you're pathetic. You're 20 and you review Lego Star Wars sets. You're a kid. Or kids like Lego, you know. Um, and so, thankfully, no, I don't have to deal with that. But if you do, um, that's kind of my advice. Just don't let it bug you. I know that can be really tricky because sometimes it's... Words really can hurt, you know. Um, but just you know, you'll make it. And, you know, if someday you're successful, like, like, let's use MNR as an example. If you're successful like him someday, people will be jealous that you're making money off of buying a Lego set and talking about it to yourself, basically, and then putting it on the internet, you know. Um, so someday it'll work out for all of us, right? I hope so. But so that's going to do it for today's video. So thank you all very much for your questions. I do always appreciate it, like I said earlier in this video. Um, and if you have a question for our next ASA, drop it in the comments down below. Leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it. And I will see you all this Friday or, I don't know, Monday or something. I'll see you sometime in the future, okay? Peace out.